because they were cables all around that weren't safe. So we couldn't really fly in any room. So you need lots of cables here, and then a voice recording, and then many power banks, and a selfie stick, uh, whatever you can imagine. So how do we solve this? Maybe we sat and we started saying, OK, what are the functionalities required or desired when we want to have one tool only to gather data? We obviously wanted to replicate. Thank you. We obviously wanted to replicate a, to replicate a paper form. So we wanted to have the capability of inputting any sort of data, so numbers and or words. But we also wanted to take pictures, voice recording, and videos. We want the app to you to work online and offline because most of the time, for all the things we mentioned, you don't get to have connection because you are in a remote place and your phone is not connecting to any network. And using your network work is just very expensive. So you need to wait to go to the hotel, maybe, to get some <coughs> network. You want to track your location, but you want to also be able to track your location inside the map. And then you want to add the cap you want those data to be fastly synchronized to an external platform such as the spatial uh, data um, the SDI that uh, Enrica is developing or any other sort of dashboard. You want to have them as output without any effort of this any external effort in digitalizing your data, and you want to be able to have this app working for any sort of phone, so Android or iPhone or Microsoft. So we came up with this um, app called Device Magic. So Device Magic, first of all, I need to say, something very important. We didn't want to program the app ourselves. The programming an app, first of all, is not easy, and it needs someone that maintains the app. And a developer costs a fortune. So instead of us doing that, we choose an app that could present the majority of functionalities we wanted, with someone else taking care of the, of the maintenance of the app itself. So if there is a bug, I know who to contact to fix the bug, because we pay a subscription. So Device Magic is available for Android and iPhones, and as the majority of the functionalities we just mentioned, <coughs> is flexible and easy to implement as a preset flowchart plus some optional subforms to use. It has a GPS location and allows to record of timestamps and also allows for record of validation. And I'm going to show you the importance of the validation of the data you collect. 